the last episode, we made it through a gale into the safety of Cape May, New Jersey. In this episode, we leave Cape May, we go up the Delaware Bay, across the C&D Canal, and down through the Chesapeake Bay to Annapolis. We are back from our drive to Houston, Texas and back to New Jersey uh, to vote. We are leaving South Jersey Marina early tomorrow morning to head to Delaware Bay down the C&D Canal and then to Chesapeake Bay. Should be a trip. Should be a fun trip. It should be good weather. But you've seen our track record so far, so I guess we'll find out. Come on, you bold sailor boy. We've got loads of room up here. You're doing awesome. All you bold sailors who follow the whale, our captain has told us, and we hope he speaks true. There's plenty we had planned a four-day trip to Norfolk, Virginia, and for this first day, we were going to go through the Cape May Canal, up the Delaware Bay, and into the C and D Canal, where we'd stay at Schaefer Marina for our first night. The next morning we were once again fogged in, but this time we were safe in a marina and we just waited there until it burned off. Once the weather cleared, our plan was to get across the Chesapeake Bay to Middle River and Bowley's Marina before the sun set. We're in Chesapeake Bay. that has come off the engine twice leading it to overheat is working fine and I check it every time before we leave. It's now a different hose that's leaking down underneath so I'm gonna have to replace that one. Well 
here's where it was leaking from. And I'm, I'm, I'm so surprised that the electrical tape that had been wrapped around it didn't hold that together. <laughs> is open. I'm hearing water in the pipe, but I am not seeing any leaks. Well, I don't want to jinx it, but so far it's a miracle. It's a repair that actually went the way it was meant to go. Our third day was planned to be an easy one, down the Chesapeake to Annapolis. I'm gonna do the other side too, I want you to do it. So we are in the Chesapeake Bay. There's like no one but us out here. Yeah, there's like no one but us. All morning, the Chesapeake Bay was flat calm. In the afternoon, the winds were mild, the waves small. I was starting to get anxious. Everything seemed to be going right for the first time ever. We reached Annapolis with no problems. Hey Arthur. Yes. We just did our first mooring. We did. Hey Robert. We just did our first mooring. First I know. <laughs> Hopefully it holds and we don't drift away in the middle of the night and die. Wait, or what? Bump into someone else. Oh, We're in Annapolis. <laughs> There is something I absolutely love about being on a mooring. We are completely surrounded by water. It's, it's like a moat. It's, it's like your own private island. And we're just, we're just out here in the middle of Annapolis Harbor. And it's, it's so cool. You know, we're just hanging out, middle of the harbor, not going anywhere. Don't need to go anywhere. I love this. I just love this. We spent the next day in Annapolis, seeing reminders of our nation's proud history and some remnants of its less proud moments. We returned to the boat that evening, ready to tackle the next two days of the Chesapeake and on to Norfolk. Thank you, sir. You're good. We got everything. All yep. right, guys, have a good evening. Thank you. In the next episode, we make it to Solomon's Island, where the weather is absolutely gorgeous. And then we make it to Norfolk, where it isn't. bold sailor boys who've rounded the horn. Come all you bold sailors who follow the whale. Our captain has told us, and we hope he speaks true. There's plenty of whales, my boys, off the coast of Peru. Early one morning, just as the sun rose, a man on the foremast cried out, There she blows. Row away, says our captain. Where does she lay? Three points to the east, and not a mile away. And it's lower your boats, my boys, after him travels. Stay clear of his flukes, or he'll flip you to the devil. Lay on with them oars, boys, make your boats fly. Him to vomit and the blood for to smell and in ten minutes
it's time a boys who wrote Dolphin's album. We brought him to Dover and played alongside, and then we opened with our blubber hooks to rub him off his hide. Commenced cutting in boys and then drawing out, and the mate in the main so loud, loud he did shout. a board house for a barrel of flour spend all our money on them pretty girls ashore and when it's all gone my boys we'll go wheeling for more